What's going on everybody? It's Stock Picks by Tim and I'm gonna keep this video really short. I've had a really long day. I had to replace a windshield or have it replaced I should say. I've got my daughter with me so we're gonna make this video kind of quick but I wanted to go over CleanSpark here today. We did have some interesting action in terms of share price and we had some recent news and we also have an upcoming event that's gonna be very important. So let's take a quick look. Don't forget to like subscribe, ring the notification bell. Now one thing I wanted to show you is we had an interesting day today. We had almost a 7% gain from bottom to top on the day and then it all just started getting taken back well why did it pop in the first place this isn't just the overall market the market from what i saw had a pretty iffy day well why clean spark likely popped and then it all was taken back was likely because of this news here investment analyst at Cantor fitzgerald gave clean spark an overweight rating with a five dollar price target which is a little over double where it's at now that caused a quick little pump and dump and right now isn't the market to be following these analyst price targets unless you want to be extremely quick I personally think that's good to see. However, I see CleanSpark as more than a $20 stock one day. And I do think when we get back into the right market, when in my opinion, CleanSpark does reach $5 and above, these analysts will be coming in with higher price targets. They definitely don't want to come in too lofty and just sounding too outrageous. And we also have to realize that in this current environment, no one's willing to take risks. No one's willing to just put it all on the line or put it all on the table. And this is why any positive news is usually quickly taken away in terms of share price. Now I did want to show you something on the chart here and this is from our 2021 peak right around $40. We do have a descending resistance. It does appear like we were breaking out of it, but it's kind of just writing it down and the market doesn't seem to be looking at this descending resistance breakout as a likely scenario for clean spark we do have an event coming up that people likely aren't wanting to risk yet and this is their earnings now they are only expecting 27 million dollars but i think if this does come out positive this can cause a little breakout and technical traders will see the break and positive movement out of this descending resistance right now it seems like the market isn't taking the bait and it doesn't help that bitcoin recently hit a new low less than a month ago now one thing i wanted to show you here for clean spark that i think um people are going to be watching for here for earnings at least is the year over year numbers. Now, December of last year reported, they reported 27 million, it was expected 23. They had a nice beat in revenue there. And this was one of the first blow away quarters when we just started seeing that explosive growth. The quarter after that was 40 something million. And then Bitcoin started declining and their revenue started shrinking. Now I do personally think they will beat this 25 million and I'll give you a separate video here soon about their actual numbers and we can see that in their mining updates. They give us basically what their revenue is. But I'm really going to be looking for that year over year. I want to see over 27.14 million. But in reality, you're still going to see quarter over quarter decrease in revenue. Unless they were to beat this 31 million, which I find kind of unlikely. But overall, we all know in the back end, this company is doing great things. They're continuing to increase their hash rate. They're continuing to make wise acquisitions and even making improvements in efficiency with things like immersion cooling. Now, once Bitcoin cooperates, in my opinion, within a year, CleanSpark will be back on that upward trajectory. And we'll also be getting those analysts with those price targets. But this simple $5 price target is, I guess, a step in the right direction. However, I wouldn't necessarily weigh anything an analyst says or a YouTuber for that matter. Always do your own research. I definitely appreciate you guys. Thanks, as always, for watching and take it easy.